Hello, 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 and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Butterfly. We're here on Call of Duty Warzone today, as it is COD Wednesday. Game plan for today is to play a little bit of Caldera. Now, bear with me here, as I probably only played it three times in the past week, and that is it. Never played this prior. Never, No more, no less have I ever played this map, so... We're trying to get used to it for whenever King Kong and Godzilla come out because I'm really stoked for this event. I'm excited to see how they go about it, what their end game is here, and just see if it's a half decent event. So I've been practicing just a tiny bit. Best I've done is probably 79th place, so I'm no pro, but then again, I was never really in the whole war zone scene, so I've been really trying to practice. So with all that said and out of the way, let's get this COD Wednesday on the roll. All right, well, here we go. Fingers crossed that we do well. Uh, I honestly don't really have any classes set up that are half decent for this map. Then again, I don't even really know how the whole class setup thing works. So, yeah. Like I said, I'm still getting things figured out. Still getting used to some things. Because I got the brain that's more used to Fortnite in all honesty. So, let's go ahead and figure out where we're going to drop. I'm not entirely sure where people typically drop here on this map i kind of just do my own thing but last time i played it ended out half decent i'd say for like a newbie here but then again i'm probably screwed because i have a bright blue operator dumbest idea possible let's see if we could drop down here it's kind of odd it kind of trips me out that it's first person whenever you're gliding in forgetting everything's just a tap for me i don't have to hold it what do we got here a shotgun that's trash we'll take that and we got restock all right well i actually got a loadout for once i've never done that before so that felt kind of weird but got this bad boy another terrible choice for me because it's bright orange and white it's a great idea here on caldera isn't it I think personally the only thing that I don't necessarily like for Caldera is the density of it. The shrubbery and everything is just way too thick. That was trash. Why did, why did I even contest? Oh my goodness. You can't even hear anybody. I didn't hear this guy at all. How do people play this game? Like I didn't hear a single thing from that guy. Not a single sound. Does he have dead silence on somehow or something? Oh to man, battle. this is gonna suck. Lose and your fight is over. I guess the plus side is you can actually see where they're at. Fight, that was trash. I suck at this game. 71st place. Why? Well, I, I did eight places better than I did last time whenever I played this game. We're gonna hop into another game, see how I do. All right, well, here we are, take two. I'm not entirely sure if this is a good spot to land, but landed here anyway, and I also saw that there was about three other people that came here as well. So let's get ourselves prepped here. Yeah, I can hear somebody and actually see somebody right over here. It's kind of odd whenever it comes to Call of Duty Warzone. Whenever you're so used to things like Fortnite, it's kind of weird to see that you can actually see a blip of the enemies and everything whenever they're shooting. Got my first kill, though. That's nice. Plus for me. Oh, shoot. We got, actually got somebody coming up on us. Where's this guy? Down here somewhere. Oh, my gosh. I actually almost had my second kill. That would have been so much better than dying. Obviously. All right, let's see if we could actually win this. Literally never won a gulag. Can I kill this guy? What if I kill this guy? Are you actually able to kill them? Because that would kind of be cool. Wait, if I killed that guy, would I actually basically just pass the gulag? All right, let's see how we do. Oh, pistol this time. All right. I feel like I got a chance here for once. Heck yeah. First gulag one ever. Setting that up in the books. This is probably the only thing I know whenever it comes to Warzone Peak. It's like the go-to spot to drop. 
And of course, we already got a guy over here. He dropped me somehow. Give me that. Oh my gosh, I actually almost won. Well, here we are, take three. And just gonna land over here at some random spot. I didn't even know how the blips worked. Actually, we'll go down here. Seems like a fairly decent spot. We got three spots plus a tower to check out. Might actually get a half decent weapon to chill in the tower for a minute. Scope the land. Oh, plenty of plates in here. That's a plus. Actually, we got a sniper. Wow. Of course. Guy's in the window of that blue house, but he's not going to peek me again, apparently. There he is. Broke his armor. Come on, he's like one hit. Should have played it up, maybe. But I, then again, I have two and a half plates. Should be half decent here. Let's see where this guy went. Chilling up here, or did he exit out the back? It's probably who the guy in the truck was shooting at. Alright, I think we're good. I think that guy bailed out. I don't think anybody's in that truck. I can't tell. I'd assume not since it, the way it was rolling. But. This might be better. Would it help if I actually knew some of my weapons whenever it comes to Call of Duty? Some of the older weapons kind of just left my brain. Got a loadout drop, but I don't think I'm worried about it. I think I'm going to try to just play the game with floor loot the entire way. Might as well stuff a plate in here. What do we got? Got a guy shooting at me from... Why can I not hit that guy? I haven't hit that guy at all. Oh my gosh, I actually got an elimination from a long shot. No way. I'm amazing myself. Hope that nobody's coming over here since we are near a loadout drop. It's probably a dumb idea to drop onto this, but... No, we'll take this, considering I already have another long-range weapon that's actually half-decent. And we finally have plenty of ammo for it, so even better. I feel like it was actually a pretty good idea to still be up to her, but... Not entirely sure then again as well. On the plus side of things, I've now surpassed my record here. Made it to 68th place here in Warzone. Moving up in the world. Next thing you know, I'll be a COD pro. Yeah, right. Now, nah, sometimes you gotta have faith in yourself. Yeah, anything's possible. Kind of like having all these houses here. It's pretty convenient. We just go from house to house because aside from that, you can't really be out in the open. Probably get smacked. That's something actually up. Oh! The blimp's like a quick redeploy. That's so convenient. Oh, that's nice. Quick redeploy anywhere. That's so convenient. I wonder what's over here at this tower. I'm going to go check out this tower, actually. See what this is all about. What is that? Into the new safe zone. Gas is closing in. Oh my gosh. I just moved all the way over here to find out that the safe zone's way back over there again. Come on. You've actually got to be kidding me. Oh shoot, we got somebody like right on our tail here. Do not like that. Chilling here near the shrubs kind of convenient. Hiding in this foliage since I'm a bright blue guy. Foliage? I don't think that's the right word. I think foliage is leaves on the ground. Inbound. Waiting to see if this guy will take this car and move. Otherwise, I kind of want it, even though I don't know how the vehicles run, so... Alright, screw it. We're taking that car. Oh, snap. Somebody way down the hill is shooting at me. I believe. I believe, I believe. Alright. Alright, so it's basically like GTA. That's convenient. I feel like I have to stay on the road in order for it to run half decent. 
Oh no, this thing's awesome. What a beast. Wow, this vehicle's a beast. If I ever fi need to find another vehicle, I hope it's this one. I used up two bullets, and I don't think that it's that worth it to reload those two bullets, but... Then again, I also spent probably like... 52 bullets on that one person. I feel like the DP is a lot better than this gun. But it doesn't have a scope. I like the fact that this one has this nice scope on here for me. Makes it convenient for this big large map. Wow, we're really moving up in the world here in this this game. We're 35th place. Could we potentially see our first win here? Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. There's a load up. Oh my gosh, I gotta get used to this. Come on. Anyway, there's a loadout drop right there. I feel like somebody's gotta be watching that. But I don't want to push it because I'm not that worried about getting kills here. kind of want to stay alive a little bit more than getting 10 kills or 5 kills, whatever kills. There's a guy right outside this house. There's a four-wheeler there, but that guy has the vehicle that kind of just blocks them all in. Is he going to get out? He did get out, too. I want to sneak up on him, but I feel like I'm going to be too loud. All right, he's gone. Good. Now we can take this four-wheeler and zip out of here. I thought I... What kind of custom paint job is that? What was I thinking? I didn't know I had this paint job. That's terrible. Who drives around in Caldera with a bright blue and orange paint job? We'll grab that. Only 20 bullets. Which would be better? Ruby Brilliance? Nah, I feel like the MP40 here would be better. I know I've done a lot of camping this match, but this is quite the improvement on my part. We actually have a handful of houses around here, so it'd be good to zip to the next one, but I'm not entirely sure where the next circle is going to be yet. I think I'll just go right into resort here, just a straight line over here, hop into this building here UAV active. to stick somewhere over there. Then again, somebody has a UAV, so that's great. I feel like there's going to be a lot of people in here. At least a handful of people that want to come in here. This is all there is to this building. Oh, we need floors. We need floors. We need height. I just downed him. Oh my gosh, no way. Got him. No way. No way, no way, no way. What's that guy even doing? Did he not realize that you have this entire open area up above here? Like, literally anybody could be walking through this area. Alright, where can I move to? We got 30 seconds to figure out where to move to, and I kind of need a building to help me out. If this building actually has a window to exit out of, I could definitely move to that little bit left there. As long as I don't die to this other person that's near me. So... Yeah, nine seconds left. We gotta move. Got an ATV right here, though, so... Oh, no, 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 no. Where's this guy at? Need that ATV. I got people spraying me from all directions. What? Yeah, there's that guy spraying me. This guy hiding in the shrub. Yeah, I was screwed. 15th place though, that is unbelievable for me. Two eliminations. Best I've ever done. All right, well there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is COD Wednesday. A little bit of Caldera gameplay. Like I said, I'm no pro. And as you can see, I did mix up my character a little bit more now. So from further games on, maybe I'll do a little bit better than 15th place. But 15th place nonetheless is still quite the improvement for me. So let's see, maybe in the future if I get a win. And if I get it off camera, I'm going to cut that little clip and definitely add it in the next video here. But either way, hopefully you guys did enjoy this COD Wednesday. Hopefully you guys are having a great May the 4th, watching a lot of Star Wars doing anything Star Wars related. And if you guys enjoy Fortnite, definitely check out yesterday's video as they did just drop a new update 
with all the lightsabers, E11s, all kinds of stuff. The item shop also has Star Wars stuff in it, so if you guys are into Star Wars at all, definitely check out that video. Or if you're into Fortnite at all, definitely check out that video. And yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy. As always, spread love, radiate positivity, and try to smile. See ya.